going to have to clear out some of these chestnuts that keep falling from the tree before we can have our tea party. Unfortunately, it's not. We have a big problem. Well, I'm here to help. Thank goodness. Follow me and I'll show you what's going on. <laughs> Everyone's so excited for the Rainbow Ball Tournament. It only happens once a year. Villagers come from miles around. But how can they play Rainbow Ball with all of these Pokey Pods covering the field? Pokey Pods? They're the prickly pokey seeds that grow in our beautiful pokey pod trees. Unfortunately, every spring the pods drop to the ground and can cause problems. Hmm. hmm. Ouch! These pods are really pokey. See what I mean? That's why they're so hard to clear away. I hope we don't have to cancel the event. Everyone will be so disappointed. It's not that easy to clear away Pokey Pods. When does the Rainbow Ball Tournament begin? This afternoon. We don't have much time. Hmm. How can I help? I need a way to clear the field of these pods. A way that is easy and doesn't hurt anyone's hands. And I need to be fast, since the tournament is going to start soon. <laughs> across the field. That gives me an idea. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller.
you'd like to try. <laughs> <laughs> are flying in every direction. It's dangerous. <laughs> We won't be delaying the tournament. Because we'll be playing golf instead. Villagers arriving for Rainbow Ball saw you and the others hitting pods down your mini golf course. They thought it looked fun. Who knew cleaning up the field would be so popular? Who else wants to play Rainbow Mini Golf? <laughs> of Rainbow Ball. Everybody loves it. And it's a great way to clean up Poke Pods. Thank you so much, Rainbow Ruby. I looked all 
all over the backyard. Maybe I dropped it in the car. Maybe she lost her ring in this pile of weeds when she was weeding today. Do you think, Choco? I guess we'll have to find out later. Hurry, Choco. They must really need us in Rainbow Village. Ready, Choco? Rainbow Ruby? I'll do my best. Hmm. I'll need to observe carefully, collect clues, and be a good problem solver. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. taking off my glasses as I was falling asleep at my desk. I had a delightful dream that Princess Kiki gave me a bouquet of pink princess posies. Good thing it was only a dream. You're allergic to those flowers. Indeed I am. And when I woke up from my dream, my glasses were gone. Thunderbell stop by? Why, yes. You don't think he's the thief, do you? No, no, not our Thunderbell. So, what did you do next? I looked all over Town Hall. And I looked around the village. I stopped and talked to Tina. Uh-uh. Oh. And then I talked to Ellie. And I even talked to Jesse. No one's seen my glasses anywhere. They just disappeared. Don't worry, we'll find them. Let's talk to yeah. Gina next. Yup, left my good hat right there on the bow while I was below 
yellow deck. But when I got back, it was gone. Hmm. Choco, you dust for prints, and I'll look for other clues. Maybe they're yours, Gina. Huh? Gina, press your hands down on the dust. They match. Does that mean I'm the thief? <laughs> no, no. It just means that the thief was very clever not to leave Prince. So, when did Thunderbell come by? A while ago. He lost the spare tire for his scooter. Well, that explains that. Come on, let's go see Ella. <laughs> It was right here, my knitting needle. Uh, but when I went to look for it, it was gone. I can't knit with just one needle. Don't panic, Gally. We'll <gasps> solve the mystery. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? Huh? What's a carrot doing in my knitting basket? He loves carrots. Thunderbell take Ling Ling's glasses. We shouldn't jump to any conclusions, Gina. A good detective always collects lots of clues before solving a mystery. Let's go see what Jessie has to say. Mm -hmm. Jessie's red crayon was here. Now, no more crayon. Rabbit footprints. Has anyone seen Thunderbell lately? Last I saw, he was over by the post office mm -hmm. working on a scooter. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Hi, Thunderbell. Mm -hmm. Everything okay? Oh, hey, Rainbow Ruby. Yeah, I just forgot how to put my scooter back together. What's up? Thunderbell. Did you happen to go to Ling Ling's office, Gina's ship, Ellie's barn, and Jessie's sandbox today? Sure did. I've been looking everywhere for the spare tire for my scooter. <laughs> Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. Chaco. I must have tripped on Jessie's yo-yo. What's that doing here? <laughs> hey, that's not a yo-yo. That's my spare tire! Spare tire? Oh my, oh my. I can't see anything without my glasses. Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. I think I might know who took all of the missing things. You, you do? do? Follow me. Only Ling Ling and Thunderbell were at every place where something was missing. So one of you must have accidentally borrowed all those huh? things that didn't belong to you. Huh? Ling Ling, while you were looking for your glasses, did you take any <sighs> other things? Why, yes. I found my trunk warmer at Gina's. I recognized my back scratcher at Ellie's, and my red marker somehow wound up at Jessie's. I knew it! When you thought Thunderbell's spare tire was a yo-yo, I realized you could hardly see without your glasses. why you thought Gina's knit hat was your trunk warmer, and Ellie's knitting needle was your back scratcher, and Jessie's red crayon was your red marker. <gasps> oh my, oh my. I did take all of those things by accident. I'm so sorry, everyone. Oh, no problem. Hmm, Ling Ling's glasses must be here somewhere. make you sneeze. Right, Ling Ling? Oh, indeed they do. Well, I think that when you dreamed about the Princess Posies, you sneezed your glasses off your desk. Huh? And onto your clock. <gasps> My glasses. I can see again. Ring in these weeds. Hmm. 
wearing gloves when she was pulling weeds. Maybe her ring slipped off in one of them. <gasps> Mom, look what I found. <gasps> My ring. Oh, Ruby, how did you ever find it? Oh, just a little detective work. <laughs> <laughs> Even slower and start moving down. Now give a gentle turn. Looking great. Chaco and the plane and I are gonna take a break from crashing. Your takeoff was near perfect. You just need to keep your eyes on the plane. Don't give up. I won't. I know I'll get it right the next try. I just need to take a little break. Bye. Sure, Ruby. We'll try again later. Hmm? Ready, Chaco? Rainbow Village, here we come. <laughs> just hurried in from Rainbow Forest. We'd better get to him as soon as we can. He's terribly worried about his best friend, Chirpy. What's wrong with Chirpy? <laughs> Rainbow Ruby! Taco, did Ling Ling tell you? Chirpy wants to fly up high and see the sky! <laughs> but she can only fly a few feet above Mr. Sloth's head! She's really sad! And now, so is Mr. Sloth! Can you help? Huh? Can you? That's what I'm here to do. Woo! Great! Follow me! Good luck, Rainbow Ruby! Mr. Sloth! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Sloth! Hi, Rainbow Ruby. I hear Chirpy's feeling sad. Where is she? She always sits on your sprout. <laughs> No matter how hard she flaps, she can't get up to the sky. Mr. Sloth found Chirpy when she was a tiny egg and raised her. Huh? There was nobody to teach her how to fly, so she has to teach herself. Chirpy's ready to give up on her dream of being up in the sky. Never give up, Chirpy. If you want to get high in the sky, then high in the sky you'll go. Let's see. I need a way to get Chirpy up much higher than she's able to fly. And she needs to stay up there long enough to get a close look at uh -uh. the sky and be near the other birds. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. <laughs> Chirpy can see the sky. I have a map and compass so we know where we're going. And with my headset, I can talk to Ground Control, who will help us take off and land safely. And Chaco is my co-pilot. We're all soaring up high in the sky. Look out, sky! Here we come! Uh, wait. What are we flying? <laughs> Follow me. I'll show you. learning to fly this morning. Oh. This morning? Don't worry, I'm not an expert pilot yet, but I'm getting close. I'll be fine if I just try my best. Seatbelts, everyone! <laughs> Ready? 
ready for takeoff, Chonko? <laughs> Hi, Paige. All clear for takeoff? Ready, Rainbow Ruby. Luckily, we have Paige's ground control. Ground control helps pilots know when it's safe to take off. Get ready for takeoff! Rainbow Village. 